What's good, y'all? Uh, we talking about the slant zone two out of the uh, <laughs> slant zone two out of the big down two three six. Same setup as the cover three bluff. We're gonna base a line, pinch your D line, crash them to the right, and then QB contain. This blitzing corner right here, you can either user him, you can, so you can come here and user him, or you can just. I prefer to leave him right here, so it looks like the cover three bluff. So like, I leave him just right there. I man him up. I either. I don't know what I do. Usually, I usually I man him up. Then I always take this guy right here and like move him down, not like ten yards, because if you do this, then you might get beat. I move him down like right here, so they'll still think because like y'all know in the cover three bluff, I control my safety. So when I do that, I do this. They still think I'm controlling the safety, so they'll never suspect it's cover two. I move this guy over. Not I don't move him over. Like take, keep that in mind. I don't move him over. You move him over, that left guy running the streak, he's not gonna get there. What you're gonna do is move him down, like right there. And then now they think you're still in the cover three bluff. Because a good player, if I see someone using their linebacker, like one play, and then I'm like, okay, that's slant zone two. That's why he's not using his safety. But then if I see him using his safety, bring him all the way down here. I'm like, okay, now it's a cover three bluff. So like, so I always with the cover three bluff, I come here and stand like right here with my safety. Unless I think they're running the ball, and you can use his linebacker. Y'all gonna see. Comes in the same way as the cover three bluff. Fast, he uh, always gets there in time. So, again, base line, pinch or D line, crash him to the right. QB contain. Then I just use quick adjustments, YY, man him up. Do that. You can do this. You can do that. You can man him up on the running back. You can man him up on a receiver across the field. It's really up to you. And I always move this guy down. I just like sit right here. So, then when I start the user, I actually, I always use this guy always user this guy because uh he has the hook zone over here so i need to use the middle of the field as soon as they hike the ball i run over here and just to see what's over there and that's how you want to run that play hey but hope y'all enjoyed this uh stay tuned for more